So good morning, sir. I am Saran Sekar Patra. I read in class 10, Government High School, Menda, sir. I am from Odisha, India. So, sir, my presentation name is Earthquake Resistance Building with Automatic Detecting Alarm. So, sir, it is a very useful project. You know, uh, many times the uh, many times people are sleep at night, and that time earthquake hits the earth. So that time we are not alerted and unable to uh, unable to get out from the house. So uh, that's why I make this resistance building. So, so the work of resistance building is the saving life of persons who are still sleeping at the night. So sir, I made two types of uh, prevention. One is automatic resistance building with detector alarm. So detector alarm is a prevention which is provides some crucial times like uh, five to 10 minutes before when the earthquake hits the earth. So you know, uh, earthquake, uh, when earthquake hits, at the point of three to three point five in the Richter scale, it will it will be a normal it will be it will be a normal earthquake, and it gives us it provides us some crucial times like five to seven or ten hardly ten minutes, when it's uh, when it's hits like a uh, like a strong earthquake like uh, 7 or 7.5 or above in the Richter scale, it will not provide us some crucial times. So, uh, so my working procedure is I used, I used a sensor or a speaker into my prevention. So, so we, uh, we used a sensor which it still remains at the depth of earth like 500 to 700 feet like a bore well. So um, when earthquake started, the earthquake's waves are hit into the sensor and sen sensor is notified us. And sensor notified the speaker, uh, the, uh, the sensor notified the speaker and speaker, uh, uh, speaker started shouting. That's why we know an earthquake is coming into seven to uh, 10 minutes. So that's why we, we are all, we are, alert and uh, get out from the home and uh, when and whenever we was still remains into house due to important work we can we can uh, we can saved by the uh, earthquake resistance building we use some flexible pillars into the you know we are used pillars from building houses so uh, we made them pillar flexible so these flexible pillars are moving according to earthquake wave. So that's why I make this project. Can I, sir, can I present my model here? Hello? Yes, please do so. Yes, go ahead. Okay, sir. Sir, it is my earthquake. It is my earthquake detector alarm. Sir, it is it is a wire which is used ahead of galvanized iron wires. So in the real life, so in the real life, we used galvanized iron, which was called GI wire. So GI wire is uh, is uh, uh, trembling and uh, and touches this uh, and touches this part. And whenever it touches this part, the earthquake is, uh, earthquake is uh, detecting like this sound. So, sir, this sensor is very useful sensor. This sensor have many. This sensor have many uses. So, you know, uh, our home is Khorda, and Khorda is a Khorda is the area which is the nearby of Odisha's elephant sanctuary so my village is near of elephant sanctuary so uh, so many time elephants were come and uh, destroy our farm fields so that's why the uh, that's why our farmers are very trouble uh, so that's why they are they are they are covered his farm field in the in the iron wire like four to five layers according to the height of the bamboo which were uh, which were uh, 
which were digging in the depth of uh, depth of land so uh, sometimes uh, elephants were come and destroy our farm fields up to end so we used that time uh, a sensor which was uh, detecting the wave uh, and the detecting of the walking wave uh, of elephants and uh, and detect us and uh, and provide a very dangerous sound and elephants were elephants were still backing himself so this is our prevention so it is a it is a use of this sensor but my prevention is how to overcome earthquake uh, because earthquake is a disaster which has no prevention till now so sir uh, so sir uh, you see this is my flexible pillars i used here some small spring but uh, in the real life uh, but the real life we but real life we use some flexible pillars so you know the difference of the normal house and earthquake house when uh, sir uh, it is a prevention which gives us uh, some uh, which uh, which helps us in the normal uh, earthquake time uh, whenever a earthquake it still remaining a very dangerous 7 uh, 7 or 7.5 or above in the richter scale it will not help us it will not save us so it could helps us in normal earthquake it it could saves us in normal earthquake it is a prevention sir i tried to make a prevention i don't i don't tell it it is a 100% successfully prevention it is it is my idea to representing how to overcome a disaster like earthquake so it is my presentation and sir and sir it is my uh, earthquake uh, detector alarm it is a very useful it is not expensive also uh, you, you see here how did it work whenever a earthquake earthquake uh, uh, earthquake still hits the home is always uh, crumbling and uh, you see you see the you see you see the no, you see the normal house how it is struggling here and you see the uh, register house which was uh, which was still moving according to the earthquake you see how the register building moves according to the earthquake so you see difference and uh, it is the specific it is the specific it is a speciality of this project Uh, so it is a very useful project for the human society and this house have very long longevity to save us so it is not very expensive we should implement in the large scale of the profile and i forget i forget a very important uh, a very important word my project is belongs to uh, the goal of six which was industry innovation and infrastructures so so uh, it is my so it is my model and it is my idea it is not very expensive we should implemented in the large scale in the society thank you wow thank you thanks for your presentation and uh, your idea i think your idea of uh, um focuses on something very important which is prevention rather than trying to repair the damage and uh earthquakes is definitely something really really important right um what do you think about this joseph yeah yeah thank you so much aturo this is this is quite i mean sanrash you you are phenomenal i i listen to you and i listen to how okay, you you are able to uh, bring out such a preventive solution that seeks to address a problem that is actually challenging to your country and i must say that um, your experiment is quite amazing um looking at what um the normal houses um res or react when there is an earthquake and what your solution is going to offer i think this is quite amazing and i love it i love it so much yeah thank you thank you sir hi hi uh, 
Uh, can Go I ahead. ask, like, how long did it take you? Hello, pardon yeah. me, please repeat it again. Uh, how long did it take you to do the whole project? I can't hear, ma'am. Uh, how, um, how long did it take? How long did it take you to make this? Sir? कितना दिन लगा आपको ये बनाने में कितना समय लगा आपको ये बनाने में सर सर लाइक थ्री टू फाइव डेज ओह इट टुक इम थ्री टू फाइव डेज टू मेक दिस मॉडल यस ओके हाँ डेस लॉन्ग साइड सर आई आई मेड दिस प्रोजेक्ट ऑफ थर्मोकोल सो दैट्स व्हाई आई I used to five to I used three to five days to make him to make it, sir. Sincerely, sincerely, I think that's quite amazing. I was thinking you're going to say two weeks, one month, or maybe six <laughs> months. Yeah. So, so, so we want to also know what are the materials you had used in putting this together. Sir, I used waste materials in here, sir. Sir, Amazing. like plastics, plastic bottles, sir, and uh, you know a hanger we, uh, which was used to keep our clothes in our uh, in our wardrobe. This broken, this broken hanger we used in here, sir. Amazing. You know what I what I find really interesting, Saranj, is the way you design the sensor. Actually, you grabbed a physical a physical phenomena, and you managed to combine materials to make an inexpensive sensor, and that's huh. the way many sensors work. So I think that you're going to come with many ideas to use physical physical phenomena to build sensors for other things like detect fires or perhaps detect motion or detect other things. Uh, you have done a wonderful work, uh, job uh, building this um, inexpensive uh, sensor that can be used everywhere. So uh, I, I do really congratulate you on that. Thank you. Thank you, Alert, sir. All right. So, um, well, thank you, Saranj, for, for that. And I hope you join us in, the, in, in, in a future Global Innovation Field Trip to show, show us your ideas, okay? Sir, so any question for me? Well, I think I think that that that's uh, those are the questions that we have, and um, well, thank you, thank you again, congratulations. Yeah, thank you, thank you, thank you, Saraj, for such a phenomenal uh, presentation and innovation. We are glad, and we look forward to seeing you come up with um, more of it, and and as 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 well translate it to. Um, the real solutions so that our world will become better. Thank you. Thank you, Lord sir. Yeah. All right. Sir, I am glad to hear presenting, sir. Yeah. Bye. You did great. Thank you.